All right, let's see. Let's see the battery in this thing. <clears throat> I was noting or, you know, this thing comes with a 150 milliamp charger which needs to charge two and a half amps 2500 so it takes 16 hours to charge th the three 18650s in here I'm assuming that's what's in here that's just stupid I would be so tempted to get a, a 12 volt, uh, 12 volt one amp and charge that, charge it with that. And it looks like we got to take the whole damn thing apart. I thought this was going to be like a door that came off. Oh, well. Let's see if it all the same size bat, the same size screws. So far. Place the battery in this. All right, so this totally has to come all the way apart. <clears throat> then we'll be able to see the wires of the motor. Uh, see, see if this is robust. See if this has six 18650s in there. Or if it's just three. Sends voltage down there. Oh, wait, did this rubber not want to come apart? Uh oh. How do I deal with that? Three eighteen six fifties, right there. Oh, those detachable. Was it like permanent? Not permanent. So here's our motor. It's a twelve volt motor, of course. Twelve volt. Let's not accidentally turn that on.
27 watt, 2018. <clears throat> so they don't want you replacing this battery. Which is awesome. And there's the board. I don't know if you need to see the rest of it. There, we'll just take it all out. So we see your red 18650 in there. Three cell lithium 18650s. Any fuses on here? That's a fuse. There's a fuse right there. F2, which generally means there's an F1. So where's F1? <clears throat> F2. That should be a fuse right there. So then where's F1? scanning, I don't see anything. I'm going to have to look closer to later. two fuses on there maybe maybe it's just maybe there isn't two fuses and they just labeled it f2 because a new design or something Sorry guys. All right, hold the motor so it doesn't jump up out of here. If I didn't hold it, it would jump up out. Alright. Well there you go. So you got your 318650 proprietary. Have fun getting those out. I mean you can, but you know, you know how it is. You're gonna have to desire this crap. To get that out of there. Kicked across, maybe they're kicked across this side. These two are going to be connected. Yeah, there you go. If you're going to replace them, you got to do this crap and you get those two connected. Some sort of metal weld. The soldering is a real pain. Right, so, how's this going? This is good. This is good. This wire got a breach or just gets crushed? I think it's got a breach right there. All right, then. Gotta get this thing to go in, however the hell it was.
There you go. Wiggle, wiggle. Wiggle, wiggle. And this just inserts in. Oh, I see it's got a tab right there. Oh, that keys it. It's keyed. It's not sticky or anything. It just sits in there. All right. There we go. Let's try another piece. Now keep that horse there and I'll get another piece. 